Hey guys, it's Ariel. So today I'm doing an empties. I don't think I've ever done one of these. And I've been collecting this stuff like the last, I don't know, three, four weeks. And I always forget. I throw stuff out. I'm like, oh my gosh, I should have added it. But then it's just too late. So today I am going to be showing you a couple of the things. Most of it's bath stuff and a couple of makeup stuff. Before I get into it, thank you guys so much. Um, my anniversary was Sunday and a lot of you guys said uh, congratulations on Instagram. And you can follow me up with the link below. But my gift was this beautiful rose gold Morganite diamond ring. I absolutely love rose gold. Um, it's just so shiny, so sparkly. We took a little vacay in Ohio. It wasn't much of a vacay, but um, it was just to see my family and friends. And I took off anyways. We're going to head to New York, but um, some family things came up. And I'm like, you know what? Why not go see my family first? So... What a great husband, right? <laughs> he wasn't too thrilled about New York anyway, so it's more like I wanted to go, but he wanted to please me, so whatever. So let's jump into it. So the first thing is, I'm just going to throw them right out there, bath products. One is this lip, not the lip scrub, the body scrub. This is coconut lime, totally empty, as you can tell. Love this stuff. This is probably my favorite freaking scent. Um, I don't know how well it's going to focus because the light is super bright in here because, I don't know, I think it's like 12 o'clock a.m., and then the other product is a Bath and Body Works and a cucumber melon. I should have like got a trash bag. I should have had better thinking. Um, the next one is kind of like a hygienic product. Q-tips, everyone uses these. Um, these are the precision precision ones. They have like the point. So it's really good to do a uh, wing eyeliner, touch up your lips, or if you have anything like really stubborn you want to get at. Like in your ear or something I don't know but I like these I usually use them for makeup the next thing is a hair product um, it's not, I don't think it's really meant for hair let me say that much um, this is the flawless gold this is from Bath and Body Works as well it's really good when you have a tan you spray it all over yourself there's a gold sheen there's like hardly anything left of this I love this stuff absolutely love it next time they have a sale I think I picked this up for three bucks and I think it's normally like 14? I don't know. So I won't pay full price for it, but I definitely will buy this again on the next sale. You know they always have sales. <sighs> so I want to go really fast. I want to go as fast as I can through this and uh, get it over with. The next thing is the Sugar Lip Scrub by um, Fresh. I went to go pick up one of these and come to find out this was $22. And I kind of bought this on a splurge one year. And I guess I didn't know how much it was. But then I'm like, oh my gosh. So I went to Lush and bought um, the, their lip scrubs. I don't like them because they dry out really fast if you don't use them pretty quickly. But whatever. Um, way cheaper than this. And I like this scent a lot better. Then a little uh, potion, primer potion. This is the original in um, Greed. I think this is the original. For like the second one or something. I don't know much. I don't know anything about makeup, obviously. The next one is a BB Cream L'Oreal in Light. I really like BB Creams now that I have discovered. My face is completely dry, flaky, and uh, foundation doesn't help. I am going to get a Real Techniques uh, sponge because I had heard great reviews. So Ulta is in my future, actually tomorrow. Smashbox, totally empty. Love this stuff to death. <laughs> um, really expensive. I actually went to Sephora like a week ago to buy some more and I picked up the white one but it was in the wrong box so I think someone was like trying to chip the store. I don't know if they're different prices but it was in the wrong box. I really don't know. So I took it back and like wrong product, wrong box and I'm like okay. So they gave me my money back which was good and I think they have a really good return policy anyways. Then the Makeup Forever Professionals. This is an aqua black just liquid liner or the gel liner. One of those two. Cream waterproof liner. Then, hold on, my thing is going crazy. There we go. Then I got, um, I don't know if I used it all or got rid of it, but this is like a little mini gel thing. I've been using like gel for my brows, but it's pretty much completely empty and there's like tons of gaps in it, like air bubbles. So I think that's good to go in the trash. Age Rewind. Everyone loves this stuff. Totally used it all up. I love to use this under my eyes. 
cover blemishes it is so easy to like highlight what you want to highlight and be done with it and then just smudge it out and fix it up the next one is a mac pencil and i think it's black russian i can hardly even see everything's so worn out and it's just like a little stub now i have also another little stub that little stub fell on the ground and this one is a sephora and i'm pretty sure this was um like a nano one so an extra small one to begin with but uh there might be a little more use out of it but it's really hard oh this is a lip liner i don't know if i said that but I'm sorry i keep clicking my lips i've just noticed this video is gonna be wonky but whatever i never recorded one of these cotton rounds lamo lamo dove deodorant um i actually really like this stuff and i'll definitely get it again right now for my one i'm using is like a miniature one that uh i don't have with me anymore but it was just one i took on vacation i bought one so that's what i'm using right now so i'll have to buy a new one real soon Oop. this is the malibu treatment um the original let me just say this um it's really annoying to use it it's sandy gritty stuff but i highlighted my hair and i don't know if you guys are going to be able to tell or not but i used this before just to get all the grime and dirt off so the low lights would stick a lot better because i have bleached hair and i use so much product on my hair i just wanted fresh hair to start with oh look how cute my earrings are <laughs> yeah and i talked about this talked about that talked about that okay lip balm this is the um jack black one i bought it because i liked mint i like mint anything around my mouth area i like it mint i like mint lip liner <laughs> um lip gloss lipstick anything going in or around my mouth i like it to be mint i feel fresher that way i don't know just my opinion and what i like and then voluminous uh false lashes i didn't like this stuff but i used it all up the problem i guess that's how you know when your <sighs> mascara is dry is it's really flaky when i put it on it's like it's no good it's just doesn't feel good putting on my eyelashes and uh I think that's done with I think it's over with lashes <laughs> um I use lashes a lot I really like my uh lily lashes I think that's what they're called I use them so much but uh I thought I would just show you a thing of lashes but this is bullseye the lily lashes I love those but this is going in the trash as well and do not ask me why I only used one lash one day I have no clue <laughs> Then I have a mini cherry blossoms, not gonna focus, glue for eyelashes, 10 developer. And this is in the ion one, so you can buy this as Sally's. Cheapy weepy stuff and uh, easy for everyone to get. And the last but not least is these. Uh, I, I don't even know if I made a full video of how much I hate these and why I wish I never spent my money on these. But these are the little things that you put on the bottom of your foot. It's supposed to suck out all the bad, like, irons and stuff. Let me just say this. It smells like barbecue sauce. And the husband was not having it. He's like, take those things off your feet or go sleep in the other room. And, uh, they do. It says lavender all over the box. It's not lavender. It's barbecue buffalo sauce or something gross. But that's about it. If I forgot anything, sorry. I guess you guys won't know anyways. I hope you guys have a good one. Comment below if you like this video. I try to make it as short, as sweet as possible. And I hope you guys have a good one. Ciao. And check out the Doyon bar. There might be some interesting uh, tiddly bits down there. Alright, bye guys.